Bonjour and welcome to today's episode of the wonderful world of capital punishment. As you can tell by my outrageous accent, today we shall be covering the French Revolution. Back in the day, there were many yeah, popular yeah. methods of execution, yeah, such as beheading off, with an yeah. axe or being drawn and quartered by horses. Yeah, but of yeah, course, yeah, they, they had their setbacks. Off, yeah. Yeah, like with the axe. Yeah, the axe yeah, yeah, would sometimes yeah, get stuck yeah, in the prisoner's off, neck. Yeah. This is rather uncomfortable. And the drawing and quartering just got too messy. As the French Revolution had just occurred and there were more prisoners that needed executing, there had to be a better method of execution. Henceforth, the guillotine. Yay, hooray! Somebody turn off that music? Oh, good God, shut it off! What, you don't like my music? I'll play you a different song. Yay, hooray! As I'm about ready to be executed, I'm planning on testing one of my hypotheses that I will remain alive after being beheaded. Yeah, 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 chop their heads off, yeah! Can you see it? I'm blinking! Somebody should be recording this. And here we have the esteemed Robespierre, who is in charge of the selections of the execution. Thank you, I'm very- Oh, my wig just blew off. Mumble, mumble, mutter, he mutter, wears mutter, a wig? Mutter, that liar. Mumble, 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 chop off his head. Mutter, mutter, mutter. Hey, there's nobody left to execute. I know, that guy with the French accent from TV. Uh, and then the people got tired of the executions and stopped using the guillotine. Join us in our next episode where we explore the methods of execution used by the Empire. You have failed me for the last time.